came to say, Salam, so we want a table from heaven to show, show us who you are. And Allah warned Sayyidina Isa salam, if we send this table, they're forced to eat at it and those who don't eat at it will be severely punished. You can't take something from Allah you can't see something from Allah's miracles and then walk from them. You are now accountable for what you do. So are you warning? You want to do that? You say, no, no, we want to have the table from heaven. I want to show them. It was all about showing miracles. As soon as this table begins to approach to the earth, the proud ones, we don't need to eat from that. And they left. And pride and bad character always rejects the signs of Allah because of hasad and jealousy. They weren't really looking for a miracle, they were just jealous of what Sayyidina Isa had. As soon as he proved it, no, that I am connected with Allah now look at the table. They said, oh, it's probably magic and they walked away. This table is always coming for the nation of Sayyidina Muhammad It's not one time. Tables of zikr and mafir, tremendous blessings. But what these rijal and what Allah want to inspire within our heart, Allah is not interested for the world and the physical world. Allah is interested for the soul and malakut, the heavens. Allah has no time. This is a description of the people of Maqam al Ihsan. These are the people whom are Ahlil Basira. Their hearts are open. They do what they do for what Allah is going to reward them. So, means they don't do things for money. They don't set up maqams and stations that if you pay this money, you get this maqam. If you pay this money, you get this maqam. Allah says, no, that doesn't how it work. My rijal, they ask nothing. They ask nothing. There's no fee that you pay and you reach a darajat. It's blood, sweat and tears is the only way to reach Allah's satisfaction.